Very cool. Um, can you get, share just some other tips? I know you said a lot during your recruiting story, which I think is going to be helpful for these kids, but can you share some other tips from the coaching side of what they can do to kind of keep this recruiting process going throughout this time? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I think that I will say, um, I know most players are pretty keen on sending the emails, especially around tournament time and, and showcases and making sure they're sending their schedule and stuff like that. And so obviously those emails might look a little bit different right now in terms of you can't send your schedule or your club team or your high school team, whatever it is. But I think this is a good time to know that, um, coaches are checking that email, right? And, and myself being, myself included in that, um, that is part of our responsibilities as graduate assistants is to kind of uh, look through those emails. So now more than ever, uh, those emails are being checked and they're being read through and, uh, and kind of read through with a fine tooth comb, so to speak. So um, I think it's important to continue that. I don't think um, just because you don't have a, a, a tournament or anything going on, I don't think this is the time to, uh, back off on the emails. I think if anything, um, just letting coaches know what you're up to, right? Um, where you're at in the recruiting process, what what data, what your day to day is looking like, whatever you can um, <clears throat> kind of offer in terms of uh, uh, something different. I guess it's again just like your soccer. It's a time to get creative um, and kind of think outside the box, so to speak. So. Um, I do think it's important, though, to co to maintain that communication. And if even if you're of, of the recruiting age of not being able to be contacted by coaches or whatever it is, um, I think that it's still important to uh, to still maintain that communication and, and at least have those coaches know that you're still interested and um, and see those emails coming through. Yeah. And if they have video and such, they can you know, they can send that if they haven't sent it yet or, or put together some sort of, I don't know, highlight video or something. Right, like right, right. Especially just like we were talking about earlier about watching your own film. Maybe from watching your own film, you start to uh, you start to compile a highlight video of all the things that you see yourself doing well. And um, I, I, if anything, that's an ego boost for you, right? <laughs> Even if yeah. you make that highlight, of it, highlight video just for yourself. Um, but yeah, just to have that and then to send out to other coaches. Um, yeah, definitely. Definitely a good tool to use. Yeah. Awesome. All right. Yeah. Well, I think we definitely gave them a lot of recruiting info that they can take it and hopefully start to build those relationships for them. For sure. For sure.